hi everyone this update about bitcoin so what we can expect it now that's what i'm here to talk about still not yet subscribe the channel subscribe the channel press the like button leave a comment join with us in a facebook page guys we need to build this community as well always i'm going to give you the important details about the market and what is really happening in the market so everyone knows uh usdc is already uh, deepak and silicon valley bank is already in the danger zone right now they're almost going to be the bank run and the bitcoin over the sudden started to bounce actually this bounce also i already predict where the price going to be heading that's the reason i started to give one more prediction where what i expected right now in the market and the market situation so previously i already predict guys you guys remember two weeks ago Bitcoin price is supposed to be land at this particular level. Actually, I shared that content uh, 25th February. Okay, guys. So we'll check it out the evidence content. So previously I talked about 14 days ago, Bitcoin anyhow, it's going to be landed in case of we lost the support level of 22,779. So same as it is already dropped one of the particular levels and I give the reasons why we are going to drop as well so we'll check it out that one guys all the numbers what we receive is the very less opportunity to market to bounce so that's what we seen and can even you guys can see in my thumbnail it's showing clearly 20 to 20 000 again sorry for us so imagine guys i give the clear prediction where the price going to be heading and might be you did not check till the end that's what happened please guys i would love to request everyone watch the video till the end considering in the future to little bit dropped so someone can ask why and how the considering this entire move as a fifth wave so we should enter the correction wave guys so the correction wave my expectation i want i don't want to see so you guys can see the entire wave count and the fifth levels there is measures you guys can see exactly the peak is the one of the fifth level 382 fifth level and where we get the bounce that is the exactly fifth level right now we are be holding uh, 23,015 uh, that is one of fifth level so that meaning our wave count is amazing so all the FIP level already fit as a support and resistance. So the next thing I would love to see in case of price fall below 22,700 till here, the expectation 50 percentage Fibonacci retracement and the 618 Fibonacci retracement, that's going to be 19,255. That's the expectation. Below 20,000, maybe one more time, we will get the chance to buy in the bottom. So I already gave the expectation we will have the chance to buy in the bottom below 20,000 one more time. And right now there is some risk. And the previous content I already shared about the Bitcoin, what is the risk as well. So if you're trading right now, if you're going to enter some position right now, guys, the risk is there. So someone can ask why, what is the risk? So if I show you something very important details, how the S&P 500 react previously. So S&P 500, what happened actually, if I change the D. So previously S&P 500 already break out the channel after that retest and they get the bounce and the pullback is happened right now S&P 500 inside the uh, channel so right now one more time what we're seeing the s p 500 drop to the channel so previously you guys remember i gave one of the prediction s p 500 supposed to be landed here so same as it is already landed we did not see the support and the next support level is the one of the green box this is the massive buying level for s p 500 so in case of we did not hold that particular place so the same scenario is possibility they have to follow so we already break out the channel retest and right now what we're going to see the bounce that the bounce could be touched here that the sky uh, blue color line the trend line you guys can see the light blue color trend line 
so possibility there to touch here so after that we can expect the massive pullback as well so according to the candle still the candle did not close guys the weekly candle did not close so you guys can see right now almost 22,000 that is the super bullish news but tomorrow is the day the entire world is going to be upside down so someone can ask why and the how so the reason of that because of the now the banking system in the us there's in a danger you guys can see all already within a one week almost three banks uh have issues there have the huge issues not in the little bit issue they are in a lot of big issues and they are facing the liquidation uh, liquidate issues so they don't have the enough in case of the customer request they don't have enough funds to give it give it to the customer so that is the one of issues and they are not profit uh, last three quarters because of the rate hikes and in case of the fed and the government started to increase again the rates so what will happen entire banking system will collapse so in case of us entire banking system is collapsed what will happen the us is going to down guys so that is the reason they will start to post the rate hikes and in case of they started to money print again this inflation will end in a 15 or 20 that's for sure in the us inflation rate so they are never going to take back again the two percentage and Jerome Powell is starting to take the two percentage that is the his biggest challenge right now what we see here Bitcoin is ready to bounce Bitcoin already completed the bear market and people started to uh, do so many things to bring back the Bitcoin because so many people they did not enter the market in a 15,000 level say the large retailers they love to bring back bitcoin in a 15,000 so then the people have a fear so many people going to sell because might be bitcoin going to be 10,000 that is the fear everyone have so in that kind of situation what will happen we will sell our all the bitcoins and all the institutions they're going to buy our bitcoins guys if you're in a long term if you invest so please guys do not sell the bitcoin till 2025 january that's my prediction because we're going to see the massive amount of money and the massive amount of volume in the bitcoins people going to jump like crazy so you will see the reaction and please guys noted the date today what i explained you 2025 in till january we are going to get the bitcoin as a 200000 above so right now what we seeing almost uh, 1300 dollar increase that's amazing and if i zoom out the daily chart you guys can see the clear engulfing candle and the last two candles are engulfed the previous two candles that's amazing bullish news previously what happened here that similar kind of scenario all the drops we increase and achieve the targets where we drop it so right now almost we touch 22,100 so previously you guys remember i already talked about the levels i want to do something here The confirmation we already complete the correction that's what i just want to check okay so right now to complete the entire correction we just touch 382 fip level previously you guys remember i already talked about in case of we drop below than the 22,779. so we are going to land it here the same as it is in case of v cross above 7 uh, 22,779 we're going to achieve 27,000 that is must so check it out guys where the price going to be heading right now what i want to do there is one clear channel we seeing the bottom lines already achieved again so one more time in case of if i draw the channel like this so this channel is a little bit danger because we're seeing the bottom level of the channel one more time right now crystal clear okay 
so right now the situation you guys can see this is the major trend line we bounce and the proper retest because previously we did not retest the trend line right now there is proper retest exactly and we i expected price already landed that particular levels right now the first challenge we need to chase the the levels first of all we need to move above the price of 22,779 and we need to chase break the trend line guys so that's what i'm waiting for i hopefully we can see that one and tomorrow is going to be a little bit um massy and entire crypto market and the stock market as well you guys can see already the dollar index where the dollar index is standing and the huge rejection and previously i already talked about the same level guys and how the uh, uh dixie chart is work you guys remember my expectation levels i give the level this is the target this is the trend line this trend line is starting from when and to where so still dixie is following the same and it's going to be the resistant in case of highly unlikely we reach that level we can expect a huge drop in the dixie chart so right now what we're seeing is still we did not cross that my particular levels so the concerning not to be a inverted head and shoulder pattern so right now what you guys are seeing as a clear inverted head and shoulder pattern i really don't want to see the inverted head and shoulder pattern this is supposed to be one more leg down below 100 that's going to be amazing for crypto market that's what we are waiting for and the gold people started to enter the gold because of even right now stock is moving downwards and the bank all the banks they they are in a super fear right now in case of they started to increase the rates they're going to suffer the people don't have a place to take it their money because stock market forex and everything it's in a danger zone so they're trying to believe the gold is the safe heaven and right now bitcoin as well so i hopefully you will have a clear idea and a clear picture about the market what we can expect it in future still not yet subscribe the channel guys subscribe the channel press the like button leave a comment always i would love to give you along with the proof all the details thank you very much have a lovely day be safe